So my name is Joe Fiducia. I am the owner and creator, sort of, of the truck sitting behind me, Optimus Prime. And it is a replica truck, not the actual truck. Correct. It is actually the world's first and only fan-built replica of Optimus in that particular style. Uh, there's two other trucks in the world that look like this. They're the trucks that are owned by Paramount and Daimler. We decided to take it a step further and, as fans of Transformers, actually build a full-size model of it. You know, most people just have normal jobs. How did this come about? Well, I got a normal job as well, but this, this had a lot of inspiration behind it. Um, this was my impossible dream. This was something that was so far-fetched for me, and I decided to take it on because I wanted to prove to my son to never be afraid to try. Um, you know, he's eight years or he's nine years old now, and I, I hope that he'll grow up one day never having that fear of, uh, you know, uncertainty after what I've done here with this. This definitely is no uncertainty. That's so cool. Yeah, this is uh, this was a lot of work that went into it. It was about five months of labor. Uh, we had about 25 people that were involved in the build. Uh, we worked on it from the summer of 2016, so it was uh, basically between May and September that we were working on it. Um, it's a brand new 2017 Western Star. It was actually custom built from the factory floor to become Optimus Prime. So. Directly from the uh, factory, we had things like the right tank sizes, uh, the right yeah. tire sizes, no windows on the cab here. Whatever we can get from the factory was a very important starting point. Was, this a, was there a Kickstarter for this or what? This was all self-funded. Um, this is a life savings. This is a second mortgage. This is a lot of debt and determination. Um, our hope is that one of these days very soon, Hasbro will jump on board and help sponsor us to travel around the country with this thing. Um, they did give us the legal permission to build it, but outside of that, we've heard nothing else. So uh, our hope is that you know we'll try to keep going as long as we can. This is not an easy thing to do, uh, but hopefully they'll pick up on what we're doing and, and will be willing to help us out. How many cons have you been to so far? Well, we've only had it on the road since September, October time frame of last year. So I'd say in that time, maybe seven or eight conventions. Uh, we've gone as far as Winnipeg up in Canada, uh, Quebec City. So we do travel quite extensively with it. Does this thing touch ground ever? <laughs> How do you get this thing going? We put it in drive and go. We just, oh yeah. Imagine seeing this thing rolling down the highway. It's quite a sight to see, man. So you're really driving this bad boy? Oh yeah, we'll drive it right out of here tomorrow. We'll be driving to the next location next week. What? That's awesome. I'm looking at the tires like this thing hasn't touched ground, has it? No, this actually has about 29,000 miles on it right now. But uh, it, that's where half of the labor is. It's a full-time job just cleaning this thing. That is so cool. I saw you yesterday, like on top of the rig, just cleaning it. And I was like, that man is de dedicated. Yeah, it's it's a lot of work, you know. Anyone out there who complains about having to clean your Civic or your, your Mercedes Benz, try cleaning Optimus Prime and you'll know how much labor this actually is. Okay, um, is there any kind of uh, uh, just life advice you want to give to anybody about living their dreams? I'd say it's the same thing that I tell my son every day, you know. I mean... I don't want to say nothing's impossible, but don't be afraid to pursue the impossible. Don't be afraid to take on a challenge that you've never done. Even if you don't have all the answers, don't be afraid to try. Even if you fail, you can say you tried. Okay. Um, where can people find you to book you or anything? If you guys are interested in hiring us or uh, you know bringing us to a party, convention, we pick up kids from school, we do weddings. Um, we definitely try to do a lot with the fans with this in addition to the Comic Cons. You can find us on Facebook, just type in the words Optimus is here, or you can go on Instagram, type in the same yeah, words. You guys are the Bumblebee too. Yeah, Bumblebee and Barricade, yes, you might have seen us. We were at uh, Twin Tears last week. That's not our car, those are some friends of ours, uh, but we do like to travel as a pack. The three of us, we call ourselves Team Prime, hopefully building up a team with uh, Ironhide, Ratchet, and whoever else wants to join us. So awesome. Thank you a bunch. Hey, I appreciate it, man. Roll out, everybody. Thanks for stopping by and checking it out.